Oh, turn, turn down the fan from there a little bit. Cool. So now we're trying as much as we can today to get you content in these Mercedes Benz um, EV range called the EQ. We're now in the EQ 450 Plus, EQS 450 Plus. Yeah, which is an equivalent to the Mercedes Benz S Class. As you can see, it's an appeal that we can raise up. Um, we indicate over there and as you can see look at the dash look at the camera we've got the twin sun roofs oh and this is another sign that this is a what do they call it ambient lightning there's that and there's also it's environmentally friendly um, we like this color here which is like hey man and the soft touch dash the steering hey these seats ah. My friend says opulence, opulence in abundance. <laughs> Yo, and this one is, uh, I think, what are the power figures again here? Uh, 245 uh, kilowatts. Yeah. yeah. In terms of uh, torque in 560. Yeah, 560. 560 newmans of torque, 245 kilowatts of power. As you can see, there's our battery. It's rear wheel drive. And we're driving it as a normal person now because you don't speed in the Mercedes bands. Not that you want people to see you, but you want people to know you're worthy. And life is good, even though we live in South Africa. But of course, you're in the Mercedes Benz S Class. EQS. Oh man, these seats are ventilated too. Oh my goodness, and I think my seats can massage me. Yo, so. Aha! Sure. Very, very powerful. And we do hope we can get some seat time in that 53 because we're told that's got a thousand meters of torque. And the last time a Mercedes Benz had a thousand meters of torque was in the Mercedes Benz S65. Yeah, that was the one limited torque, five speed auto gearbox. That was insane, sending power to the rear wheels. This, on the other hand, I agree with Hunsak, the ride is sublime. I like this, the feel of this, it's spacious, makes me feel like, I think it's got a head-up display, but I don't know if we have it on. No, it's got a head-up display, yeah, it's got a thing. Oh man, we've got about 80%, it's 7% of base to power. Whew. I'm a little overwhelmed, so I need to actually gather myself, so yeah. Hmm. Now, most of these cars, that things you may know and you may not know, the ambient lighting, and there's the perfume, and then there's music that you can hear in these cars that can be aligned to whatever mood you are in when you get into this car. So if you're tired, it can be refreshing and relaxing, but we don't advise that if you're gonna be driving yourself. So if you're sitting over there, you can tell your driver to put music that's soothing and relaxes you after a day, um, and it also can, whatever's coming out the vents here, can be perfumed. Imagine, what a time to be alive. Yo, I'm just like bongi man. Hmm. Loving this. I can see why my friend Ntsabwa is quite excited. It is quite something. Hey. No, no, no. There's something about the suspension or the wheels just absorbing the bumps. I know. 10 out of 10. For what you said there. The suspension. Mm. Yeah. Hmm. You hardly feel like you're in cloud now. Yes! Oh. Oh, this it's like it's floating. Though. Hey, this pillow yeah. though, guys. Yo, uh-uh. What is that other? There was a place here in Joker where my former boss used to love. It had ladies that would actually massage you and then other things would happen <laughs> afterwards. This, hey, this pillow. Hey, yeah, man. Hey, I, 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 I would remove this pillow if I bought this car and just be normal like other people. Aggravated by log shedding and I mean, imagine sitting in traffic like this and you're smiling while other people are aggravated. Oh, well, then, then you know you're doing something wrong. Yep. Oh, my goodness. Take the left and then right and the sure. Go. You can put me in dynamic mode now. Yeah. Yeah. It's on. Yeah. Cool. And now we're switching over to sports mode. I see this name dynamic. Oh my sake. Oh. Oh. What is B 
beautiful about it is that while I felt that I was safe, the concept was not compromised. It took the bump, but we didn't feel like we mid air, we're gonna bottom up when we came back. Yeah, man. This is how cars should drive. Stress free. This would actually see this. Yeah, this one. I know. This one. I know. Yeah, you see, I even forget indicators. <laughs> I know it's it's been a while since I've driven a car that's made me very this happy. Uh, this one scores a 9.5. There's always room for improvement. It's always room for improvement. Um, while it's very while I can't see where they should would improve in this car, but a 9.5 is a very very high score. And I know some people want to say, but why 9.5 for something that the country is going through load shedding? This car's got a range of over 500 k's. Now, with a range of over 500 k, of course, it can recoup all the energy as you're braking. You're probably going to charge this car if you're doing a lot of driving once a week. I'm talking now on the basis of someone living in Eastern Cape in PE. Unlike Joburg, where someone says they're coming in 10 minutes, that means it's an hour. <laughs> Inclusive of load shedding or no load shedding. So, and I think you can go where close to about, you know, yeah, I think, no, I'm quite impressed. I'm quite impressed. And I mean, that's not mm. from a lack of experience in like electric vehicles, but you pick up these cars nicely and really, really. You know what? One other thing that we need to test in this car. Can we put the sound system on? Home. It's Kim Farnick at Jesse Clegg on 947. I'll follow you. I know, done. 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 We're happy. Done. We stick on 9.5. Possibly one of the best cars we've driven in a long time. When I say the best, in a lot of aspects. Guys, it's an electric version of a Mercedes Benz S Class. If you know motoring, if you know cars, yeah. We're happy. Like, subscribe. Tell us what you think. The Mercedes Benz EQS 450 Plus.